Hey, what's up you guys? My name is I'm Tim Marine and uh gonna be playing some Resident Evil Operation Raccoon City. And uh um, <clears throat> sorry about this whole uh main menu thing. I was just kinda it was this is supposed to be a live commentary at first, but it got really messed up and I decided not to use it, so um I'm just sitting here watching it. Um searching for a match right now. I'm going to be playing a, a game called Biohazard. And uh, that little purple vial right there contains G-Virus. <laughs> Sorry, I spaced out. Um, it contains a thing called G-Virus and uh, you the game type is based on you and your team. It's uh, two teams of four you have to collect five vials of G-Virus in order to win. And uh, I just joined a match in here. It's not too far in. I believe the score is one to one. Uh, first one to five wins. And uh, it's just some of the skills and stuff. Picking the skills, picking the gun, and the pistol. <laughs> so, um, I joined in kind of late. Uh, sorry the video kind of drags on. But, uh, you know. <laughs> Anyways, um, figured I'd kind of talk about Raccoon City and, uh, my thoughts on it a little bit. Uh, f b before I start, though. Well, first off, I want to say I do have a cold, so if I sound weird, uh, <laughs> that's, uh, that. Like that. Uh, um, anyway. First off, though, I do want to say that I didn't play Resident Evil 1, 2, 3, or 4. I did watch quite a few gameplays on 4, because I thought it was interesting, um, but I did play 5, and, uh, yeah, I got this. That's a whole shitload of fire. <laughs> and this guy just grabs onto me and decides that I look yummy. Doesn't he look like Obama? Alright, someone tell me that that did not look like Obama. <laughs> anyway, um, I just completely spaced out, but these guys, those guys with the red faces, I think they're called like crimson something, um, I don't even understand what to do with them. Is. That happens not too often in this game where you and your opponent kill each other simultaneously. Ah, excuse me. That happened, uh, in Halo a lot, actually. Um, anyways. So, let's start off by talking about the campaign. Uh, I, I think the campaign to this game was pretty good. Uh, I'd probably give it about a 9 out of 10 if I had to. Um, I think it flowed really good. Cutscenes weren't all that great. I mean, like, when it went full-on cutscene, but... Uh, some of it was just... I don't know. I don't know, I just don't really think it was 10, but it, it was, don't get me wrong, it was really good. If, if you guys don't have this game and you like Resident Evil, I suggest picking it up. And, uh, wow, we're only not even four minutes in. I already feel like I'm running out of things to talk about. But, um, anyway, uh, my opinion is it's a really good game. Um... That's, um, that's pretty much the, um, campaign, though. It's, uh, my opinion on the campaign. I think it's really good. Um, that's a fun thing to do if, uh, if you get infected and you have antiviral spray. Go near a bunch of zombies when you spray it. <laughs> They're all just like, blah! <laughs> and they die, too. So, um, obviously it's antiviral and they're infected. Anyways, you see that guy, and he's got that purple thing up his butt. That is the G-Virus, and, um, he is running towards this thing, which is just to the right of me right now, and, um, he ran back there, probably to get some cover or something, but I ended up raping him anyways. Uh, um, run over, and I grabbed the G-Virus, it's a purple thing, and now I shove it up my butt. And, uh, now I have to make it all the way back to my base in order to capture it. And, uh, that's pretty much biohazard for you. Um, 
It's not really based on kills, but it does tell you how many kills you get. I freaking ran out of ammo right here. All I had was my pistol. Two enemies are right there in the doorway. Bam, teammate, incendiary grenade. Thanks, bro. <laughs> um, then that bitch tries to kill me, and then, ooh, ooh, here she comes, flame gun. Bam, killed her. All right, ready? Run! <laughs> Luckily, I find a green herb right there, and then another one right there. So, um, yeah. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's Biohazard for you. Different maps have, like, uh, different special enemies, too. Um, this map has liquors. Um, one map I played on, I've only, I haven't played on too many maps, but, um, <clears throat> One map I played on had the, uh, the oh, what the fuck are they called? Those big motherfuckers in trench coats. I can't think of what they're called. Y you guys know what I'm talking about. <laughs> but, uh, those guys, and, uh, this map has hunters. Or no, not this map has hunters, but there are maps with hunters. Um, you'll see me encounter a liquor here in a second when I have no freaking health. Um, I don't get too many kills this match. I think I, I think I, actually, I don't know how that just happened. There's a zombie's head going through my head. It scared the piss out of me. I think that liquor part's right here. I want to say, yeah, because they're running this door to my right. Um, but, um, th there's the liquor. I was like, crap, just shoot the crate open. Oh no, <laughs> I missed every bullet. And then it just grabs me anyway. If you look at my health, it's way too low to be dealing with that. Wanted to pick up the flamethrower, but I was like, screw it, I'll pick up the herb first, and uh, pick up the flamethrower. And this is great. Bam. Flamethrower, I think, is a really powerful weapon. Um, for some reason, I lit myself on fire? I don't know, but, uh, I think it has, like, no range. I don't think. And, uh, but it does have power, so I think it's a really good gun. Um, but yeah, my thoughts on the game. I think it's a really good game. Uh, this guy, I don't even know what he was doing. I'm just gonna burn his ass. And bam! Sit down, brother. <laughs> Give me that G virus. I'm gonna run. Run all the way back. I think I just took a bullet in my ass, like right before I went through that door. Pick up this heavy machine gun, which is practically full on ammo, but. I'm almost dead right here, and I thought that fire was going to kill me, but if you look at my health, again, I'm, like, practically dead. Um, ah, I can't get through the doorway, and, uh, this was, uh, pretty much a clusterfuck getting back, and, you know, I was kind of scrambling, and then that guy, he was like, you look like you got some nice flesh, boy. Gobble it up. <laughs> so, um, so I secured the virus again. All right there. You get like, I don't even know. I'm watching my XP right now. I didn't even notice it earlier, but I mean, I guess you get quite a lot of XP for doing that. You know, like 500, I would say. Um, you get an achievement, or if you're on PS3, I guess they're called trophies. That bitch burns me right to hell. Um, and uh, you get an achievement. Uh, for collecting three of them in one match, which I actually got the match right before this one that I played. Um, and uh, the match right before this one, I did an amazing him. And I was like, you know what, I'm going to record. And then I do this one, and I was like, terrible. And that, I ran over to that guy because it was another one of those guys that I thought was Obama. And I was like, you can't tell me that does not look like Obama. But <laughs> Yeah, whatever. I, I was just like, screw it. And then that one infected me somehow, so... If you get infected, your screen will just start to turn blue, and you'll see, like, right towards the end of this, when, I, when I'm searching for antiviral spray, I'm... My sc I can barely see. <laughs> and, uh, see? It's getting worse, getting worse, and I was like, oh, dear God, someone help me. And then, uh, if you look right here, this guy, right there, he's, like, running away. I was like, oh, God, because if you pick up an herb, it'll heal you, and you'll get a little bit better. I went to go grab that spray, and this guy grabs it, and he's like, oh, dude, I got you. Um, uh, from what I've seen, the people online in this game are really nice. Um, 
yeah, I can't really generalize that about everyone that plays this game. But uh, so far, they seem pretty nice. So um, I haven't met any like dickheads that are just like. <laughs> um, there was no way I was making it out of that. But um, yeah. <laughs> So you guys have my opinion on Raccoon City. Um, I think it's really good. Excuse me. Like I said, there's five different game types to play. <sighs> Excuse me again. I'm getting tired here. Um, you have pretty much a team deathmatch. That's all that that is. But uh, you can also get points for killing zombies and shit. And uh, yeah. And then you have this, which is Biohazard. And you have two other game types, which is Hero, Heroes, and um, Survivors. And uh, I tried them all, and I, st I still think that this is my favorite. Um, I, I don't know. It, it's kind of like... You can tell by watching it, it's almost like Capture the Flag. And here I get an achievement, and I was like, what the hell is that? <laughs> I look at it, and I got 50 opponents killed, and I was like, oh, dude. I just started playing tonight, too, and I got that. I was like, how did I get 50 kills already? It kind of baffled me, but... I mean, hey, you can't really complain, right? <laughs> but, uh... Clock is just dwindling down at this point. This guy was just completely caught off guard. And look, I have the perfect chance to kill him and watch. Nothing. I was just baffled at that point. The bitch comes out of the fire and is like, I'll save you, boy. <laughs> so, um, you can see we join. I joined late. Uh, the score was 1 to 1. And I brought us up to 4 to 1. Uh, I captured two of them. Um, but yeah, looks like. Video's almost over. I think clock says like six seconds right now. Um, so yeah, we're about to win right in here. Yep. All right. Well, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, like or you know, rate it and subscribe. See you next video. Peace.